Now, today's guest was previously a founding lead vocalist for the London Community Gospel Choir and one-fifth of the group New Colours, which was the first UK gospel group to be signed to Polygram Record Label. Now, we've spoken to her some time back, and I'm pleased to say, uh, I'm pleased to welcome Patricia Knight-Scott to the show. Let me just, uh, good evening, good evening, good evening. How are you? <laughs> Hey, Howard. Hey, you're right. It's so good to talk to you. It's been a while. It's been a yeah, while. It's good to see you again. I know I'm, I know I'm going to, probably going to break protocol, but Happy New Year. <laughs> oh, yes, Happy New Year to you. <laughs> oh, it's been a while. And um, I was just checking back um, mm. and I can't believe it. Um, I think it was 2021, 22 when we last spoke. Yeah, I um, think it's 21. Yeah, when you so you you released um, an EP, glitters. Uh, what, what did I have written? I thank you and love you that much. Yes. And where easy. where has the time gone since then, eh? No, I know. It's incredible, isn't it? I, I was speaking to you last. I was saying, oh, yeah, I've got some. Other, I've got more songs to to do, more songs yeah. to come, and blah blah blah. And the time has just blown. Yeah, we have had a doubt. It's, it waits for no um, man, as they say. Well, that's it. So, but listen, yeah, you're, you're, I mean, you do session singing. You're, you're a vocal educator, amongst other things. Um, and I'll be still uh, very much a big focus in your life. You know, music is what you do, right? Yes, absolutely, a hundred percent. Yeah, I get. I gave up the day to day day-to-day work hustle yeah you know, <laughs> just did my head in and I just thought you know what I'm going to do what God has and purposely with and um yeah that's what I've been doing and I'm really happy I, you know I, I don't get paid enough but I'm happy <laughs> what well, listen there's a, there's a lesson there right sometimes we're sometimes people are kind of you know chasing the corn as it were but uh but are they happy in their life? And actually, if you're happy, that makes a big difference, right? It makes a massive difference. Massive, massive difference. And you're good you know, at what you do. You're doing God's purpose, you know, and you, you know, you, you're doing what God has purposed you to do, you know, you feel more fulfilled. Yeah, yeah. You know? And you can you can deal with the the um you know the the uh curveballs that come, you know. Sure, a yeah. little bit more easily, I think. Anyway, well, you know, you've got the experience. You've you're you're, you're a seasoned professional, and uh, it's really good that you are uh, back recording. So, you've released or you're releasing a new single. Uh, it's a brand yes. new single, and it's called "Your Love." Now, as soon as you sent it through, I had a quick listen. And I didn't even probably, I probably got to about 30 seconds and thought, yeah, let's go on the show tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's getting a little bit of a taster and um, really, really loving the sound from the get-go. So talk us about the track. Yeah, so the track talks about um, a time in, time in my life when, when um, me and John were going through a challenging period. Um, he had a, a bout of ill health. And it was really, really challenging. And John is your husband, for context, John is your husband, right? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> My hubby. <laughs> yeah. And, um, you know, about a year after um, he, he had recovered and everything, um, I got with, um, you know, um, Patrick Golden. And I said to him, Yes. Come in. You need, yeah, you need to help me. Right, I've got a song, I said, but obviously I can't play, so <laughs> I need you to put some notes to it. <laughs> so um, we got together and um, came up with this song, and I, you know, sang, sang the melody, and you know, I was thinking, yeah, this this is the vibe that I want, and um, yeah, wrote that song, and it really came out of. That, that thankfulness and that gratefulness to God for bringing us through that period because it was a really, really challenging period for, yeah. for us, the family, 
and my church family were fantastic. They really were so, so supportive, you know. And, um, yeah, so it, it just talks about God's unconditional love. You know, He's he, he was there. God was there through it all, you know, took us through it all. And um, and it talks about my 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 love for my, for my husband as well, you know, thanking God for bringing us both through that we can continue to have that long lasting relationship together. That's um, beautiful. Yeah, that's what the song is about. The timing of it is perfect as well. They say it's Valentine's season that we're in. So there we go. <laughs> yeah, talking about love. <laughs> Absolutely works so well. So written by your co-written by yourself with uh, Patrick Golding, yeah. and but it's produced by the legendary Marcus Johnson. Legendary Marcus Johnson. Yeah, I can yeah. hear his, I can hear his his take on it. I love his yeah, vibe yeah. as well. Yeah, yeah, you can hear his vibe from Cat Music. No, that's brilliant. I mean, mm. all of that together. What what not to love, eh? What not to love. I mean, you've hit, you've hit 2024 running and, you know, what, what are the plans for uh, you and your music? Are you going to be releasing more songs? Is, just, is this a taste of things to come? Are you going to be touring? I, 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 hang on a minute. <laughs> I, 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 let's set, let's but, set an expectation there, right? <laughs> I definitely, definitely have got some more songs to, to come. Um... But I don't want to rush them. I just want them to to come naturally and organically, you know. So um, yeah, I've got I've got a couple more songs that um, I'd like to work on. And if there are any producers out there, I'm looking for, I'm looking for like like a different vibe as well because a couple of the songs that I've got they've got a totally different vibe to the songs that I have actually done before so okay yeah I'm kind of like mm, yeah yeah just thinking how how I'm gonna get those produced if you know well I mean. there's lots of good producers out there and um if mm. I can think of any I'll talk to you offline <laughs> <laughs> give you some suggestions maybe and it depends what kind of vibe you want to come and if you listen to what they've already yeah. done you may think actually yeah I can I like that kind of bringing out something different I mean you you may have a particular mm-hmm. tone and sound but actually okay. are you going to be not tunnel vision but are you uh is there a particular sound that you want or do you want to actually think I want to be different I want to maybe expose myself to a different market you know because of the style of music as well yes I think I just I just want to be organic I just want to go wherever my create creativity blows yeah you yeah. know what I mean yeah, yeah. You yeah. Be stuff in a box so you, you you've been writing your own stuff and or co-writing whichever one it is um have you ever is is there a cover you don't have to tell us but maybe in your own mind now, is there a track that you would like to cover? Maybe I've already done it. Oh, well, on on on, on the EP. Yeah, I've already covered the track that I wanted to cover. Okay, okay. Mm-hmm. So, so, so it's more about doing your own stuff now. Yeah, there isn't another one that I that I actually fancy at the moment. Who who knows? Another one might come mm. that I'd like to cover, but at the moment, no, I'm just working on my own stuff. Okay, listeners, if you if you can think of a if you can think of a track that you've heard, once you listen to the track uh, "Your Love" and you hear Patricia's voice, maybe you can think, "Oh, yeah, I can I can hear her doing this particular track as a cover." Um, but yeah, it'd be great to see you live as well. So, so um, for now, the focus is on maybe doing promoting this track, doing some more potentially during the year, and um, I suppose it's probably it's your time to shine now. You know, you've been you've been you've been you know you've done stuff as a group, you've done session singing, but it should be great to get your your music out there and let people hear who you are and the yeah, message of the music. Really, a lot of people keep saying, "Oh, you need to come out of retirement." <laughs> Yeah, so yeah, you, you're right. You're right. 
um yeah it's time to to get stuff out of there well, well we look forward to hearing more from you so tell us how people can follow you check out your music you know it's the release date is february the 9th is that correct Nine. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah absolutely so now um, by the time people listen to, to this it's a uh... me all of my socials are at patricia knight scott so there's no there are no different platforms if you go to instagram it's going to be patricia knight scott facebook patricia knight scott twitter patricia knight scott LinkedIn, Patricia Knight Scott, TikTok, Patricia Knight Scott. Hey. It's just, it's really easy. You are on everything. You are on everything. That's superb, superb. Well, we're going to be playing the track and um, people can uh, can get it. Go and, go and download it, go and buy it, support what you're doing. And uh, we look out for seeing it on um, on uh, future shows as well. We'll be sharing it with the other presenters on the station and uh, definitely uh, be hearing more from you so listen it's so good to talk to you it's been it's been too long and uh, really appreciate really appreciate uh, hearing from you about your music as well yeah thanks for having me I really appreciate it hey all the very best thank you